Hi, this is Tom Malloy. Okay, today we're talking about mistakes to avoid in film funding. The first one, and I've seen it happen many times, is that you never want to appear desperate. And I get it. You really want your movie to be made. You really want to get that financing. But desperation is the killer because uh, it, it kind of gives a negative vibe to the whole thing is, is the best way to put it is that um, it, they people can sense that desperation and they don't want to invest with a desperate person so if you have that confidence it's the complete opposite of that and then they feel like they're being allowed in an opportunity versus desperation and you really need to close that financing or you're in trouble so that's the first one the second one that I see a lot is rushing the investment and truly see this one all the time. In fact, <laughs> the reason I see it a lot is because a lot of times people will reach out to all of their networks. So people I haven't heard from in a long time will say, hey, can we reconnect? And I go, okay, and then we, we set up a Zoom or something or a face-to-face -face meeting and they say, yeah, I have this film and it needs this and that and the other thing and we're really in a crunch and we need it by Friday. <laughs> so that's, and that's a problem. You know, it, again, it, it almost ties into the desperation as well and I get it when you are shooting within two weeks or something like that and you don't have any financing in the bank, that's a scary proposition. So you're desperate and you're trying to rush, which is also a bad thing. So those are two things that I'd say you really wanna try to avoid at all costs, give yourself enough time and don't have that desperate uh, feeling in, in when, you're, when you're pitching. And the third thing that I would say is to never get into a film without having at least enough to get through production and I have in I've now produced 26 films at the time of this video and there were two films that I know where I got we started shooting them and we had about a third of the budget and they were two nightmares <laughs> big nightmares and aged me literally because then you you're thrown into that desperation and you're calling everybody and you're you know you're on the phones banging the phones trying to get any type of money in and you're at a bad position because you're desperate and you need it fast uh, but we needed those to keep the movies going and so in both situations it was kind of an accident how we got into them I didn't just say let's go and I wasn't the person that made that decision in, in either film um, but it is a situation you don't want to be in. You never want to be kind of upside down and desperate and gasping for air. So those three things all kind of link to desperation and you don't want any of that when you're trying to finance your movie.